Moo Math. Today we are going to look at the question, are these lines perpendicular? Well, what does perpendicular mean? It means that two lines cross at right angles. So I've got my pen set up to be perpendicular. That's what we're trying to figure out, but this time we're given points. Okay, so there's a rule for deciding if lines are perpendicular. We have to look at the slopes. And if the slopes are negative reciprocals of each other, or you can just multiply them together to get a negative one. If, if either of those is true, then they are truly perpendicular. So let's give it a go. Okay, so we're looking at line A contains a point negative three, zero, and one, one. And we need to find the slope of line A. So let's first write the slope equation. Slope equation is equal to y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So I'm going to take my two order pairs and I'm going to subtract the y's on top and subtract the x's on the bottom. So I'm going to take 1 minus 0 over, and if I use the 1 first, I have to use this one first, 1 minus a negative 3. And that gives me a 1 over a positive 4, so the slope of the line is 1 fourth. Now let's find the slope of line B. Okay, I'm gonna take y minus y, so negative five minus three over two minus zero. And let's subtract, that gives me negative five minus three is negative eight over two, which is a negative four. Okay, and that's the slope of line B. So here's line A's slope, and here is line B's slope. Now let's see, are they negative reciprocals of each other? They are, because a reciprocal is when you uh, flip it, okay? So four if, or one fourth, if I flip it, it becomes four over one, and negative means it's the opposite sign, so negative four is its reciprocal. So yes, they are indeed perpendicular. Let's do the second test. The second test is that they multiply to negative one. So let's just multiply these two slopes together. 1 fourth times negative 4 over 1, and that gives me negative 4 over positive 4, which is negative 1. Sure enough, that works too. So you got two ways to check it. I uh, hope this video was helpful on figuring out how do you decide if two lines are perpendicular.